Group is one of the leading business groups in Japan, whose activities range from steel manufacturing to shipbuilding and to engineering and construction of industrial plants. JFE Group has 54,000 employees and 230 group companies. Its annual sales volume amounts to 32 billion euros. JFE Engineering, with its 7,300 employees and its sales of over 2.7 billion euros, is one of the main activities of the JFE Group. It operates three specific divisions in these fields. Environmental Solution Recycling Energy Industries Steel Structures industrial machinery and research. Its engineering capability, extensive operational experiences and a clear recognition of the changes in our society give the company a foresighted vision of the future. JFE Engineering gives priority to combining its corporate growth with respect for the environment. Japan, as a densely populated country, has had to focus on environmental protection, which includes resolving the waste disposal problems. As far as this framework, JFE Engineering has been working for over 40 years to change waste into resource. From 1968 to the present day, JFE Engineering has designed and built over 150 thermal treatment plants, thus becoming one of the leading companies in the industry and contributing to Japan's success in its modern management strategy. Applying the technology, Japan has succeeded in drastic reduction in landfills, where now only 2% of the total waste is being directly landfilled. The growing awareness of environmental protection leads to the suppression of landfills and of the problems related to this kind of waste treatment. In order to put an end to the era of landfills, the European Union has adopted a waste management strategy based on recycling and recovery. Nowadays in the European Union, about 40% of the municipal waste is being landfilled after treatment. The waste that cannot be recycled should be changed to energy or other valuable products through dependable thermal treatment technologies. This is the reason why for over 40 years, JFE Engineering has developed a variety of plant solutions for waste thermal treatment. It is now able to provide all the conventional technologies in their most advanced versions. For example, the Hypergrade system, a cutting-edge development of the grade system that makes it possible to obtain the best performance ever with this type of process. The growing demand for environmental sustainability has led and will lead us to adopt increasingly strict regulations and social acceptance criteria. With this in mind, JFE has created its most advanced solution based on the gasifying process, high temperature gasifying and direct melting system. High temperature gasifying and direct melting system combines superior environmental protection performance characteristic of the gasifying process with high energy efficiency and top level reliability. The main feature of the process is indirect combustion through gasification of waste. Waste is no longer directly burnt, as is the case for conventional plants, but it is converted into gas. The gas generated is used to produce electrical and thermal energy through an efficient and controlled gas combustion process. By using this technology, it is also possible to recover incombustibles of waste as inert slag and metal, which are recycled in Japan for civil works and industrial purposes. In this way, bottom ash is no longer produced. The furnace is one of the key components of the system. Waste coming from the storage pit is fed into the furnace. In the gasifying layer inside the furnace, the waste that is placed into the furnace is converted to gas. This happens at 550 to 650 degrees Celsius by means of a controlled air supply through a secondary tuyere. Incombustible fraction of waste goes down to the melting layer, where a temperature around 1600 degrees Celsius makes melting possible. 
This high temperature is achieved with the combustion of carbon having the same function as in a blast furnace for steel making and the controlled injection of oxygen enriched air through the main tuyere. The melted in combustibles are extracted continuously and brought back to its solid state in a granular form, thus making it possible to separate metal from slag. The gas generated from waste goes up to the freeboard where it completes its conversion process. The generation of hazardous substances is prevented by the reducing atmosphere at a temperature of 850 to 950 degrees Celsius. The gas obtained from waste is combusted in the secondary combustion chamber. The heat produces high pressure and high temperature steam in a boiler. The steam generates electric power through a high efficiency steam cycle or can be used for district heating or other industrial applications. To further increase the environmental performance of the plant, the residual ashes can be collected and returned to the furnace where they can be thermally treated. After passing through a conventional flue gas treatment system, the flue gas is constantly monitored and sampled for a close verification and to record its composition. Finally, the gas is released into the atmosphere. The officially certified record in Japan shows an emission level quite lower than the regulations. Especially, the concentration of dioxins is 1,000 times lower than the regulations in Europe. The gasifying and direct melting system is the solution for solving problems associated with waste treatment in our modern society. High efficiency in power generation. An efficiency of 30% was realized in Japan. Very low environmental impact. The system prevents formation of dioxins with high temperature freeboard under the reduction atmosphere. All the plants built by JFE have been achieving much lower dioxin emission levels than the regulations. Reliability and safety. Plant reliability and safety are proven through the track records of more than 10 plants since 2003. Recycled slag and metal. Slag and metals are being used in Japan for civil works and industrial purposes, such as backfilling, road materials, paving blocks, etc. Various waste treatment. A large variety of wastes can be treated, either pre-treated or not, including sewage sludge, automobile shredder residue, hazardous waste, and even landfill waste. Variety of plant capacity. Plant capacities from one to 13 tons per hour are available. JFE's gasifying and direct melting system is a proven gasification technology that is highly appreciated by clients because of the smooth and efficient operation of the plants that have been working for many years. JFE Engineering uses sophisticated engineering combined with a vast experience to design and construct environmentally friendly plants for the future.